though it feels like it's been an eternity since the end of last year but the season's finally around the corner and, and Quinn's next Friday night it's going to be a big one isn't it? Yeah we're really looking forward to it as I said we've had plenty of time in the gym we've had a couple of friendlies you know, to blow the cobwebs out but it's uh, been a long time coming but you know, as I said it's just around the corner now um, Quinn's games don't tend to do the heart uh, many favours really they're always nip and tuck and go either way right up until the last couple of minutes a lot of real quality rugby played normally not one for the defence coaches either as in lots of points get scored so uh, we're looking forward to a, to a real uh, entertaining game uh, we, we need to start strongly like any other team does uh, last season obviously uh, where way record wasn't the best we know that I think we won nine out of eleven at home and only managed two victories away so we, we need to really start nailing them away victories if we want to start uh, um, achieving anything in sort of in the view of Premiership this year so and no better place to go and get a result than the still with that prolonged period off the squad must be in a good place physically and I guess they're going to have to be, aren't they? It's going to be a, a really testing season. Yeah, you know, it's been exactly the same for every team. So every team is going to be in exactly the same position. But certainly, you know, we've got quite a young squad. So it's, it's enabled them to, to have a much more sustained and extended uh, pre uh, conditioning block, really, which can only help them in, in the long run, really. So, um, yes, for, you know, uh, you know they're right, uh, ready to go. Add the rugby as well to you know knock the cobwebs off. So it, we're really looking forward to it. You've spoken a lot about improvement and making sure that this season is is an improvement on last year. On paper, that squad has improved, hasn't it? Yeah, I think it's a minimum requirement. I think you know we um, you don't get making huge strides forward in professional sport. Everybody wants it, but in in, in real terms, that doesn't quite happen. Uh, we've had small steps moving forward. You know, in, in the seasons I've been here, this is by far the best squad. Um, the minimum goal of any recruitment any season is to have a better squad this season before and I think we've done that consistently every year. Um, recruitment's getting tougher now because obviously with a better team and better players you'll always um, look in, in to improve that and, and by looking to improve that the pool gets smaller and smaller so recruitment's getting tougher now not easier but um, we, we are confident that our squad's in, in a much better place than it was last year but if you look around the Premiership I think every team has improved their squad so certainly doesn't give you a, any guarantees on anything. The squad are now used to playing their games at the Rico Arena and it's going to be our first full season there. How important is that and results there going to be if we want to do well this year? Well last year you know a mixture of Adams Park and the Rico um, we won 9 out of 11 so we had a pretty good return which would have put us in the top four without victories at uh, at home but if you look at our victories away would have put us well outside the top six really so we know we know that uh, first and foremost you've got to turn, turn your home ground into a fortress uh, we feel a real responsibility for us as well when we're playing at the Rico because the support we've had from Coventry and Warwickshire area has been absolutely outstanding we we need to make sure that we give them plenty of shout, or give them plenty of support. So we've got a big responsibility on the field, really, to make sure our results are right, to make sure we keep on uh, keeping the crowd, keep that excitement, keep that uh, everybody building and pulling in the right direction. And then we need to go away and perform away as well. Great. Cheers, Doug. Thanks. No worries.